It's been a long day Without you, my friend And I'll tell you all about it When I see you again We've come a long way From where we began Oh, I'll tell you all about it When I see you again When I see you what kind of video I'm going to film for you today because it's going to be a what's on my clothing rack fall 2015 edition my clothing rack has changed quite a bit the last uh, couple of weeks so I'm going to show you all of my key items and favorite items that I love to wear for upcoming fall so if you're interested in seeing that keep watching first of all a little disclaimer these clothes are not all the clothes that I own because I have all of my pants and other stuff in the closet that you see right next to me uh, and on my clothing rack I have only like my favorite most pretty clothes and I only have tops and skirts I don't have any uh, pants or uh, leggings or whatever I have them all in my closet because they don't look that pretty on my clothing rack this time I want to do this video a little bit different because I want to talk in more kind of sections if you know what I mean. So I'm going to start off with tees that I like to wear for fall. Fall is a season where you can still wear a tee without being super cold. So that we got everything I would do, you were standing there by my side, and now you gonna be the first one is this grey loose crop top from Brandy Melville, and I think I've showed this crop top in literally every what's on my cloning rack video just because it's one of my favorite tees ever and another top that I love to wear is this also from Brandy Melville very soft tee and it has cute but psycho embroidered on it and I felt that was just very me and uh, yeah very cool and I just love like quirky little t-shirts like that and the last tees that I like to wear are these two tees and they're both black uh, I really like black tees because I feel like black tees look a little bit less basic or something. I feel like everybody wears white and grey but black is a little bit more, I don't know, chic or something. This is the first top that I wanted to show you. Uh, this is from Stradivarius. I bought it in Malaga and it has a little bit of a like lace-up detailing going on. And the last tee that I wanted to show you is super basic, super simple. It's from Zara and it's just a black tee. It's a little bit longer at the back than at the front and it has just the perfect fit. And another thing that I really like to wear in the fall are bralettes. Personally, I really love the bralette trend for a couple of years now, but I just couldn't find the perfect uh, wants to fit me. How I like to wear them is or underneath a sweater sometimes I just have like a very big sweater and you don't even see them but like you know that you're wearing them. I also like to wear them under sweaters that have like I don't know a very wide neck so you can see like a little bit of the lace showing through or like see-through sweaters they're also very pretty and you can also just wear them on their own if you put like a jacket over it. This one is from Topshop and it's in my favorite color. It's like this very pretty sky blue, lavender blue color and I think it looks very good on me. This one from Pieces. This one is definitely more lingerie-ish if you know what I mean. So my next favorite key piece for fall that I wanted to show you, I already mentioned a little bit, but that are lace up tops or like literally lace up everything the first top that i wanted to show you is this lace up top from river island this is a good example of a very casual everyday lace up but if you do want to go all the way you can also wear something like this this is definitely one of my most sexy clothing items that i own I wouldn't wear this to class, to uni or whatever, only when I'm going out or like for a fashion event or something or when I'm shooting. This is not something that you can wear on a daily basis, but I do think it's very hot. Okay, and this is a little bit of a random section. I don't feel like this is a real trend or something, but I just got this uh, for my birthday and I really love it. So that's why it's on my clothing rack and that's why I'm going to show you it anyways. The things we've been through. I'll be standing right. It's this 
is a very unique blouse from River Island. What I love about it is the fact that it's so unique. Because first of all, it has a very interesting high neck, but with a cut, uh, with a cutout here as well. But the arms also have cutouts right here and right here. When you first see this, you think, okay, this is a very classy, kind of boring piece. But if you look closer, you see all the cutouts and I think it's very sexy, but nothing like too much. Now onto my favorite part of my clothing rack, sweaters. Friend, and I'll tell you all about it. This sweater has two trends in one. It has cutouts on the shoulder and I think it's a very unique thing for a sweater. I haven't seen it a lot, uh, like in previous seasons. Other trend that it has is the color, because khaki is definitely one of the hottest colors at the moment. So if you want something else that's cut out that's a little bit different, you can try a sweater like this, because this sweater is from Brandy Melville as well, so you can guess it's very comfortable and very cozy. What I like about this is that it has a lot of little cutouts like all over this sweater. So it looks very cool with a bralette. Now onto one of the biggest sweater trends and that are cool necks and turtlenecks. <laughs> Every sweater that you buy at this moment probably has a cool neck or a turtleneck. This was huge previous year, but now, as I said before, with the khaki, it's even bigger this year. So, the first sweater that I wanted to show you, and I know you probably already guessed it that I wanted to show you this, is this uh, Primark mock turtleneck oversized grey sweater. And if you watched my um, part 1 and part 2 fall haul, you know that I bought this sweater twice because I lost it once and I wanted to rebuy it again because I loved it so much and I'm so glad I did because I've been wearing this sweater a lot. And the next sweater is actually a vintage sweater and it has a roll turtleneck. I bought this sweater one or two years ago at One Piece Vintage. This sweater is a pretty unique sweater. It's from Primark and it's in this very pretty camel color and it has a slit on the side. And it has a kind of mixture between a roll turtleneck and a call neck because it's not too big but it's also not very tight fitting and it has no sleeves. And another like big thing in the fashion industry are sleeveless things, sleeveless sweaters, sleeveless blazers, sleeveless trench coats, everything sleeveless is like very on trend. And the last sweaters that I wanted to show you are cold neck sweaters. First one is this baby blue cold neck sweater from Misguided. It's cropped as well, uh, so it looks good with high-waisted jeans or like a skirt. Cold neck sweater that I wanted to show you is definitely one of my best buys previous year. I got it for 10 euros at H&M and I love this thing. I think it's very pretty that it's a very dark grey, so it looks good with black if you don't want to look like all black every time. <laughs> And um, yeah, it's also pretty long, so you can get away with wearing it with tights or leggings. Now onto jackets. Damn. I have two jackets to show you. To be honest, I'm not really a jacket kind of girl. So the first jacket that I wanted to show you is this one from Zara. I got it in a sale when I was in Greece and I think it's so pretty. The last jacket that I wanted to show you is probably a familiar one because I've been wearing the crap out of this jacket. Like, oh my god. Literally, if I throw it on over an outfit, it looks three times cooler. Like, it makes everything look so put together and so high fashion or... Well, like, not high fashion, but fashionista-ish, if you know what I mean. It's this sleeveless trench from Bershka, and I got it in a sale this summer as well. I was so skeptical about buying this, I almost didn't get it. But then I was like, okay, it looks very Kylie Jenner-ish, and I don't have anything like this, so I'll buy it. And it was probably the best decision ever, because I worn it. A lot. I definitely worn out the 20 euros that I spend on it. And another jacket kind of thing that I wanted to show you is this one. It's from H&M and it's a faux fur vest. And I really like how soft it is, of course. And I also really like the color pattern. I think it looks um, very natural. And I don't like when faux fur looks very faux. <laughs> Very minimal 
grid uh, play suit from Xbody. This is something that I can wear all year round. I wear this in the summer, in the fall, in the winter, in the spring, whatever, because it has long sleeves, it's not too hot, but it looks good with tights and like a jacket over it or a big scarf. I just really like this play suit. This two piece. I got this two piece uh, previous year at Misguided, and it's a grey knitted two piece with a cropped sweater and a mini skirt. Yeah, it looks very good with a camel coat over it, very classy. And that's everything on my clothing rack. I hope you enjoyed this video. I do have to say, these are not all of the pieces that I'm going to wear in the fall. Um, I also have like a lot of coats and like leather jackets that I like to wear in the fall that really make my outfit and I haven't shown you them because they're not on my clothing rack but if you're interested in seeing like a, I don't know a coat collection a fall winter coat collection let me know in the comments below also I have a lot of shoes a lot of shoes that I didn't show you and if you want me to do like an updated shoe closet whatever video let me know in the comments below or thumbs up this video because I would love to know what kind of video you want to see next. And with that being said, if you want to see these pieces in action, I'm going to upload a fall lookbook next week. So stay tuned for that as well. So yeah, I don't have anything else to say. Have a fucking amazing day. And I'll talk to you later. Bye guys.